in today's video we are going to be building a house off Pinterest in Bloxburg. So I don't really know how this is gonna go because um, Pinterest houses are like real life houses. For some reason I find them hard to build. So um, I'm gonna try my best and we'll see how it goes. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so I searched up a Pinterest house exterior. So I started scrolling down and then I found this house, which is kind of like what I wanted to do. So I tried to look for similar options and then I found this one, which is what I wanted to do. So for this one, I'm kind of just following along to the plan and what I see in it. I finished the shape and now I'm going to do the second floor and the roof. So as you just saw, it wouldn't let me put the roof on. The corners needed to be square, so I had to change them unfortunately. So it's gonna be a little bit different. Six and a half hours later. I just finished this and now I'm starting on working on the yard. But this did take me a few tries. I had to go back and forth for the roof because it just wasn't right every single time and it's still not perfect. So yeah, I tried my best. So now what I'm going to go ahead and do is start building the walls inside and start making the rooms. So there is a basement and an upstairs and we've got three rooms which is a pretty decent sized house. Also, something that I forgot to mention earlier is that this is going to be a fairy tale type of house. So this is going to look like a cottage inside and out. So first thing I'm doing is finishing the yard before I move on into 
furnishing and decorating the inside of the house. Um, ciao. Anyway, so... One eternity later. Alright, so now that the yard is done, I'm going to go ahead and start decorating the inside. So I'm going to finish the rest of the house and then I'll come back when that's all finished. A few inches later. This took a little bit longer than expected but I'm finally finished and now I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a tour of the cottage. Alright so this is the front yard. I tried my best to make it look like a fairy tale so I did the colorful bushes. My favorite thing out here though has to be the porch because I've never built a house with a porch before. So if you walk in, you see the dining room on the side here. Um, yeah, super cute. I decided to do um, pictures that I think would go good in a cottage. And then over here is the kitchen as well as the living room. If you make your way over here, we have a bedroom. Yeah, this is a super small bedroom. All these bedrooms are pretty small, even the master bedroom, so. The bathroom, this is pretty small too. And then over here is another bedroom. This one's a little bit bigger than the other one. Over here is the basement. Um, I didn't really know what to do down here, so I just um, put the laundry stuff down here and some cleaning stuff, some basic household things. And then over here, we have um, the pantry. Yes, I love this area. I haven't put anything in here though, so. This is the master bedroom. It's still not even that big. But just things that I think would go good in a fairy tale type house. And then over here you can um, actually go through the, the backyard. So here's the back porch. Yeah, the backyard isn't too big either. So. You can also come in through the living room. So yeah, that is the house. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And let me know what you think of the house on a scale of how I did fairy tale wise.